everyone, it's Carolyn, here to share another channeled message from the Lightkeepers, a group of angelic beings I channel on a regular basis for your support during your awakening journey. So today's channel is really a reminder of how when we go through this awakening process, we have the opportunity to look at people differently. So it's a short one and I have a few things to say and then we'll go from there. But first, as always, I'd like to welcome everybody who's new and thank you for joining me, as well as those of you who are always here and have just the nicest comments. I love hearing from you and also hearing your experiences, um, understanding what you're going through and how some of these channels relate. To you and a lot of you have some really deep experiences so i really appreciate you sharing those with me and the others who are watching the videos so anyway welcome to those of you who are new i have a welcome video on my own channel carolyn zeiser i would love if you like share and subscribe as well and if you're watching this on higher self i'm going to place a link below um, to allow you to get to a video that i created out of my distance energy healing business that helps you go through this journey it's six tips on how to create flow in your body for health and wellness. So check it out and make sure to check your email because you're going to get a verification email. And I just want to make sure you know that um, and then you'll be able to get that video. So thanks again for joining me. And here we go with the channel. I call it See Yourself in Me. See yourself in me for my light shines in your eyes. Sometimes a brighter light or darker you will find. But stay near me. For you and I are spirits in kind. Even though you may not know me, a connection is inside as one considers the light of another to find if we can just look deep enough to see the nature that we are both from, the truer of times and the light that is of one. So that's the channel. And, you know, I think it's a challenge to us because this is hard. I'm just going to say, at least it's been for me, to... It's a challenge for us to look at each person we encounter with a different lens. And maybe no lens at all, I guess. I don't know. But, and it's so hard in this human journey where, you know, we encounter all kinds of people each day. Um, some that are really easy to deal with. Others that we're just totally, you know, opposite of or even points of view. But to be able to step back from that thing we do to ourselves in humankind, where we build separation between that next person. And there's a gazillion different things we can do to create that separation between that next person. When in reality, the awakening teaches this clearly and we start feeling it deeply that we're all one, working toward the same goal of that oneness and that waking up to that. So. I, I mean, I don't know, maybe we all struggle with this all the time, or maybe it's just me, but I feel that I am a very kind, caring person. I really rarely meet a stranger, but at the same time, lots of times I feel a lot of dissonance with people too. And, you know, I'll find that, I don't know if it's really being judgy, <laughs> but being, um, well, I guess forming opinions. Well, I guess that's a judgment. I don't know. But point is, is I don't want to have to do that anymore. I would like to transcend all that. And I don't know if that's even possible um, through this journey. I'll find myself like, rather than just doing what I said in another video that's either coming up or I've done, depending on when I post this one, that really just want to be able to set aside any of that Part the mind does to us, the ego does to us, and creates those fractures between us and anything we see. And just look at things as they are without these filters we put on and then start making judgments. So I really feel this video, or excuse me, this channel speaks to doing that and knowing that we're all of the same, you know, same oneness in this journey and yet what we have is these unique beings that we've come in as our individual personalities and our individual likes and dislikes because that's what it's supposed to be right we're supposed to have these unique journeys we're not all going to get along in our human form but if we can look deeply and feel that for each person we encounter wow how powerful is that and again you know 
I don't know how well I'm doing at that. I think I'm doing better, but I think it's a very difficult thing. So I think this is challenging us to think about how we approach each person each day um, in our way. And I would challenge you along with me to see how we can continue to see the light in everyone. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. And with that, I have one last little final message. Um, I do have additional poems and sayings, they're shorter ones, on my Facebook page. If you haven't joined me already, you would probably like those. Additionally, I also offer spiritual awakening mentoring and they've been very, very popular. I offer individual sessions and I also offer over the months, um, depending on how many you think you want and where you're at in your journey. We work one-on-one, -on -one. I channel, channel regularly and I also offer you guidance through your spiritual awakening, awakening journey so that you can really feel like not only you can move forward more quickly um, in my estimation and what I've seen, but also be able to have someone to talk to about this journey and not have it be so lonely and offer some um, advice from my own journey. So the channeled information and, and then the information that I offer you as I've learned through my journey is really quite powerful and has been helpful to many people. So I would love to work with you as well. And I know I've been talking a lot about these mentoring um, sessions that I'm doing now, but I really feel that this is my um, this is one of my missions on on in this lifetime to be able to do this work. So that's why I'm so vocal about it, and I so believe in it. Anyway, I would love to work with you, and if you're interested, go out to my website. You'll see it below in the description box, and then you can go ahead and fill out the application for one-on-one -on -one mentoring, and then we'll go from there, and I'll chat with you about that. So thank you again for joining me, and I will see you all in the next video.